All right, guys, we got to take a break from Christmas videos and from Fan Mail Friday because I just got this in today. Just came in the mail. I opened it earlier just to check it out, and let me tell you, it is totally awesome. So we are going to set this up right now. I have so many animatronics that I have bought recently that I haven't even told you guys about, let alone set them up. But I am so excited about this one that we're going to set it up today. Here we go, guys. Let me show you this. I am so beyond excited. I thought this was just a rumor, and it didn't even actually exist. But here it is, the Collector's Minion. What the heck? If you guys have been watching my videos for a while, you know that I recently bought the Collector. Actually, it's probably been close to a year ago now. But he was one that I always wanted ever since I saw him in stores. I didn't buy him when I saw him in stores, so I bought him online when he became available. This guy just became available like two days ago, and I hit Add to Cart and buy it now as quickly as I possibly could. The Collector's Minion. Let's just take a close look at the box here. Look at this guy. He looks so cool. Collector's minion mouth moves as he speaks his horrifying sentiments eyes light up with red leds stands four feet tall i love how they're coming out with these small ones now young crouchy collector's minion what will be next guys i have not even watched a video to see exactly what he does but I think all he really does is basically just move back and forth just like the regular collector and just say, well, like it says on here, horrifying sentiments, which we're going to hear in just a minute. I wish I had my collector animatronic here with me right now. I would set him up and have him in the background, although I don't think the ceiling is high enough. But I would love to have him set up in the background while I'm putting this together. Unfortunately, he's in storage, so we can't do that. But we are going to set this guy up right here, right now. Check him out, see how he looks, see how he sounds, and you guys are here for it. Oh my gosh, I love opening a new animatronic. All right, we got the instructions. We got the power cord. Here's his little bag. That is so hilarious. Look how small that bag is. <laughs> All right, let's see. We got his head. There it is. There is the collector's minion's head. That is too funny. It's hollow in the back. It's not a full head. And I believe that the collector himself is all, also the same way with just a uh, with just a hollow foam head. We got this piece of foam in his mouth, so you can see that his jaw does move. Wow, that is awesome! <laughs> all right, let's see. We got his outfit here. We have the torso piece with his arms. Wow, they're zip tied on there shoulder piece. We got the hip hoop. This must be the base and a couple of other bars there. So give me a minute to get these all uh, cut off here. Okay, so we got all the pieces, parts pulled out of the box and set aside. There really isn't a whole lot to this guy. He's probably going to be pretty simple to set up. So we're going to do it right here on the table. We got the base. Attach the leg poles. Attach the hip hoop, oh, to the torso frame, and then attach the torso frame to the leg poles. Okay, so the hip hoop. All right. Okay, so that much is done. Slide the robe over and down the assembled torso frame with control box. That would be this guy here. All right, let's get the clothes out. We got a rope right there. Hmm, okay. All right, now we put on the arms. How weird, look at this. The way they have these bent up so much and how skinny those fingers look, they remind me of shrimp with the tails left on. <clears throat> I assume you bend these fingers into place. So that would be the left arm. All right, something like that. Right arm. All right, there we go. Heck. Okay. Attach the burlap bag to the hand of the left arm by wrapping the curling fingers around the rope at the top of the bag to hold it in place. Okay, so I guess that's how you do it. Attach the head. Head is on. Ah, oh, was on. 
<laughs> okay, there we go. Heads on. Now we gotta find the wires. Alright. <laughs> Looking pretty cool. All right, and the last thing is the rope around his waist. Gonna do it just like that for now. All right, let's get him plugged in and fired up. All right, he's on the sensor, guys. My master awaits. Must get flesh. Must get souls. <laughs> You look like you will be a perfect addition to our harvest feast. <sighs> Fix those fingers a little Your bit. Your flesh will feed the great evil. <sighs> Your soul will quench its thirst. <sighs> <laughs> so that's what three sayings so far? Come. Join the army in the shadows, or you will become our prey. So I think that was four sayings. Let's come up here and get a close-up shot of him. You look like you will be a perfect addition to our hardest feast. <sighs> he is pretty cool, guys. A lot of people don't like when the eyes light up. I think it looks really cool, especially if it were dark. Your flesh will feed the great evil. <sighs> Your soul will quench its thirst. <sighs> Now, I don't think he's supposed to be moving back and forth, but I kind of do wish that he did, instead of just standing still. Come, join the army in the shadows, or you will become our prey. I do love the way his face looks, though, and how his jaw moves. My master awaits. Must get flesh. Must get souls. Very cool. I do like him so much. He is a perfect addition if you have the original you collector. Look like you will be a perfect addition to our hardest feast. <sighs> <laughs> All right, guys. Well, there he is. Just a quick look. At the Collector's Minion, he was just released on the Spirit Halloween website. If you go on, you can get 20% off of him. He's only like 150 bucks to start, and then you get the 20% off. It brings it down to 120 and I believe you even get free shipping with that. I don't remember, but you'll have to go on there and look for yourself. But there he is, Collector's Minion, four feet tall. I counted four phrases. He is totally awesome and well worth the money. Music